Some doubleheader action at Joe Etzel Field on Saturday with the 7-2 Portland Pilots taking on the 3-8 Air Force Falcons. Senior designated hitter Ben Grubb right there giving the Pilots a 2-0 lead in the fourth inning with a home run off of Air Force's Michael Chechi. Freshman lefty Travis Radke on the mound for the Pilots getting some help defensively as junior second baseman Jeff Melby robs Alex Bost of a base hit with a nice diving grab in the sixth inning. Radke went six for the Pilots, allowing two runs on two hits while striking out five. Fast forward to the bottom of the sixth now. Freshman pinch hitter Cody Lenahan with a ground ball up the middle, scoring pinch runner Chet Thompson from second base. The throw goes into third and squirts away from Noah Pierce, allowing Caleb Whalen to score as well. Lenahan advancing all the way to third base. Pilots on top 4-2 after six. Looking for some insurance runs in the bottom of the eighth inning. Still up 4-2 with the bases loaded. Senior Chris Koppel lifting a fly ball down the right field line, scoring Lenahan, but then gets caught in a rundown between first and second. Ben Grubb comes around to score, giving the Pilots a 6-2 lead entering the ninth inning. Portland relievers were just as dominant as Radke. J.R. Bunda picking up the strikeout right there before handing the ball over to the closer, Owen Jones. Jones needed just nine pitches to strike out the first three batters he faced, picking up the save in the first game, his fourth of the season. Bunda and Jones combining for three innings of work, allowing just one hit with five strikeouts. Pilots win this one 6-2. to two. Win goes to Travis Rack. He's 3-0 with a 1-3-5 ERA on the season. Lost Michael Chechi 1-3. Owen Jones, fourth save. On to the second game of the doubleheader now. Redshirt sophomore Nick Armenta with a line drive down the left field line past the outstretched glove of third baseman Casey Gibson. Armenta pulling into second base with the easy stand-up double. And he's advanced to third with one out as the pilots load the bases for freshman Caleb Whalen. Whalen with a chopper to first baseman Adam Hill. Hill's throw to first, not in time. The speedy Whalen is safe, scoring Armenta from third. Portland on top, 1-0 with another freshman on the mound in Cody Watts. Watts making his first career start, keeping Air Force off balance all day with five strikeouts in five innings, allowing just one run and one hit on the afternoon. Bottom of the fifth inning now. Sophomore Zach McCoy collecting his second double of the game with a fly ball in front of a diving Alex Bost in center field. McCoy would come around to score later in the inning on a sacrifice fly by Chris Coppola as we head to more Portland reliever highlights. Senior lefty Keeler Brintison in a jam with one out and the tying run on third in a 2-1 game in the sixth. He strikes out back-to-back -back hitters to keep the lead intact. On the season, Brintison has yet to allow a run in seven and two-third innings of work. Still 2-1, Pilots in the eighth inning. Sophomore Brandon Snyder facing the pinch hitter Patrick Lobo. Tying run on second base, but Snyder with the acrobatic grab, completing the toss to first base to preserve the Pilots' lead, heading into the middle of the eighth. Top of the ninth inning. That's Owen Jones back on the mound, looking for his second save of the day. Go-ahead run at the plate, and Jones gets him to ground out softly to Michael Lucarelli over at third as the Pilots sweep the doubleheader with a 2-1 win over Air Force. Cody Watts earns his first collegiate win while Ben Bertelson falls to 0-3. Bertelson, a tough luck loser, tossing a complete game for the Falcon. Portland's bullpen on the day. Seven innings of work, four hits allowed, seven strikeouts, but more importantly, no runs or walks by the Pilots' bullpen. Portland has now won four straight and ten in a row at home, matching the program record set between the 1989 and 1990 seasons. Pilots go for the four-game sweep tomorrow as Chris Johnson takes the mound.